Welcome to SS Tutorial. Today I came here with one more new video. This video is going to be on a very important topic. So please don't skip and keep watching. Today in this video you will know about one of the most characteristic landform of river that is flood plain. So let's begin. Flood plain is nothing but an area of plain land which forms due to erosion and degradation of river. Flood plain is a flood prone area where generally every year flood occurs in the rainy season. Generally flood plain remains submerged in the rainy season and then sedimentation take place. It can be small, large and sometimes it may massive. Larger materials are deposited near to the channel and lighter materials are deposited at the far distance away from the channel. So its slope is decreases along with the length of the flood plain. As an example, we can say about Ganga River. River Ganga develop its flood plain in the state of Uttar Pradesh, Bihar and West Bengal. Let's know about the formation of the flood plain. Development of a flood plain is a controversial topic even today. There are two different opinions among geomorphologists about the formation of flood plain. One group of geomorphologists think flood plain is a depositional landform. Chorle Sagden are the proponent of this opinion. Other group of geomorphologists thinks that flood plain is an erosional landform. According to Krigme, flood plain developed due to lateral erosion of a river. Let's discuss briefly about these two different opinions one by one. Let's know how flood plains forms due to deposition. In the lower middle course and lower course of a river, where rivers are wider and channel is shallower, there in rainy season, river water level is increased by rainwater. So river cannot carry its heavy water load due to shallow channel. Then river water enter into back swamp and flood occurs. So silt, sand and mud carried with flood water are deposited into the lowland back swamp. Over time, a mostly gentle area of land or a plain land developed. This type of plain land is called as flood plain because it is formed as a result of flooding. Let's know how flood plain forms due to erosion. In the lower middle and lower course of a river, where river gradient is lower, there river flow is also lower and river gets wider due to lateral erosion and forms wider river valley on the both side of the river channel. This wider river valley remains submerged by flood water in the rainy season and here sedimentation takes place. It is called flood plain because of the predominance of flood store deposits. So we can say flood plain is an erosional landform but later sediment are deposited on flood plain by flood water and it changed its characteristics. Flood plains are divided into two parts. One of them is called Bhangar and other is called as Khadar. Let's know about Bhangor. Slightly higher, old flood plain where river flood water cannot reach and it is almost impossible to deposit new sediment is called as Bhangor. Due to lack of new sediment, Bhangor is less fertile for agriculture. Let's know about Khadar. Khadar is nothing but a lower flood plain area where flood occurs almost every year. In other words, we can say that it is a flood prone area and every year new sediment recharge take place. It is most fertile land for agriculture. In Punjab, Khadar is known as Bet. Most characteristic land from like Oxbow Lake, Natural Livy are found on flood plain which you will know in another video. That's all for you today. Hope you like this video. If you like this video then please press the like button and share with your friends. To get more new video please subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.